Hey everyone. Okay, so this is going to be something like the final product. Um, we're just going to run the script now, but before we do that, we're going to uh, exit out of the previous drawing. Okay, so here's the script in action. It's going. And uh, all the colors are random as far as I can tell. I wish I had a way of controlling them, um, because then I could actually make the logo I want, or the heading or whatever, on my first pass. Uh, so far not too bad. Now this part on the C, I don't know if you've read the code or the blog post or whatever, uh, you may hear my lamentations of having to use the sleep. Maybe it's just my version of Windows. It's not uh, a normal version of Windows. But for some reason if I don't do it, um, sometimes sometimes even in other programs, it's not just you know JavaScript browser lag. Uh, It'll like even in Excel, where I'll like program an auto hotkey script, like traverse, you know, a whole bunch of cells or whatever. Um, it'll still miss commands unless I throw sleeps in there. So maybe I, maybe I don't know. I don't know what it is, but uh, you can see it's almost on the C now. And then a little bit of a line. Yeah, I love how that grows out. It looks so. Especially when it's in red. Well, this one's turning out okay. Look at that. Well, it's doing that upwards motion thing on the crossbar. And there we go. That's pretty cool, right? Yeah, I, th I thought so. I think it's pretty cool. Maybe we'll just like add a little bit of flare along the bottom. We go like that. Maybe that's too much flare. Yeah, I think that's a little bit much. But yeah, that's pretty cool, eh? I thought so. Alright, I guess that's it. Thanks for watching.